and coming to India where at least 24 COVID patients were killed after an oxygen tank leaked at a hospital in the Indian city of Nashik. The incident took place at the government-run Dr. Zakir Hussain Hospital after oxygen supply was affected due to a leakage in the main storage tanker and it took an hour for technicians to plug the leakage. All of the victims killed in the accident were oxygen dependent or on ventilators. Panic struck patients and their family members. As oxygen supply was stopped, fire trucks were rushed to the spot to stop the leak. Meanwhile, remaining patients in need of oxygen have been shifted to other hospitals. Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi tweeted his condolences to the families of the victims. Meanwhile, a high-level probe has been ordered into the incident by Maharashtra Chief Minister Uddhav Thakare and victims' families will be compensated with 500 thousand rupees or five lakh rupees each. India is facing an acute oxygen crisis as it continues to battle second wave of COVID-19. Those infected are gasping for breath as hospitals in some states continue to face shortage of medical oxygen. They are currently operating on the edge due to the lack of oxygen. Currently India produces more than 7,500 metric tons of liquid oxygen per day. It is enough to support current requirement of medical oxygen. However, Uneven supply and logistical issues have led to an oxygen crisis. 7,500 metric ton of oxygen is produced, out of which we have allotted 6,600 metric tons of oxygen to states for medical purposes. In the coming days, we will increase this allotment of oxygen. As we have said, we are also requesting states to plan the use of oxygen properly and move toward rational use of oxygen. This is what we should try to do together. Demand for medical oxygen skyrocketed in India soon after Maharashtra started witnessing a sharp surge in the number of cases in February. The situation worsened as the second wave ravaged the country in March and April. On Wednesday, Prime Minister Narendra Modi said country faced a coronavirus storm overwhelming its health system. PM Modi said federal government was working with local authorities nationwide to ensure adequate supplies of hospital beds, oxygen and antiviral drugs to combat the huge second wave of COVID-19 pandemic.